Here's that every time we decide to make a video, we always have cats coming out to play. So now what we're going to do, I'm going to demonstrate how to teach a dog how to do turns. Now Mouse has been doing this for about seven years now, but I'm going to show you how you would start a very novice dog. A dog that is novice will appear to be comfortable in a straight line, but as soon as you start to turn, this might poke into the dog, the cart might start to rattle, and the dog might get a little scared. So um, I really urge you to be very, very patient when teaching this particular lesson. Now we're going to start by going in large circles. Um, there's no markings here, but what you can often do is go to a basketball court or a tennis court where there are already lines drawn, and you can follow the large circles. You're going to go either way, so we're going to start first by going um, in a counterclockwise direction. Good boy. Come on. So I'm going to demonstrate again how to teach a dog how to sidestep. Now Mouse has been doing this for a very long time, but with a novice dog, whenever the shafts hit them, they might not know what to do. Um, it is kind of unnatural to teach a dog how to back and to teach a dog how to sidestep. So we're teaching them unnatural behavior. Now they need a little bit of guidance. So again, there's many ways of teaching this. This is the way I was taught. And this is what you would do after the dog is already familiar with doing large spirals and tight circles. So I have a treat in my hand here. I have this hand on the shaft here. I'm going to get the dog's attention. Mouse, treat. And he's going to look. When he sidesteps, I'm pulling. Good boy. I'm pulling on the shafts until he sidesteps. Come on. Good boy. Yes. Good boy. Yes. Good boy. And I'll demonstrate again from the other side. I'm going to grab another piece of tree. Again, this hand will be pulling the dog towards me, teaching the dog to cross these front two legs. For every two times the front legs cross, the back legs should cross once. So watch carefully. Okay, Mouse, you ready? Oh, I got a treat for you. Crumbly treat. Come on. Good boy. Yes, good boy. Yes, good boy. And you do that repeatedly with the dog until they are very, very comfortable crossing their legs. And that's how you get a dog to sidestep. You're just out of the dog's reach. When the dog starts to move, help him over some good boy. Uh oh, you dropped it. He's good boy. Good boy. Yes, good boy. And then I would do the same thing on the other side. So again, I've got another treat here. This was a novice dog. Hold it right here, just out of reach. I've got my hand on the shafts here, and he's already leaning, he's edging, so just watch his feet. Come on. Good boy, yes. Good boy. Come on. Good boy, yes, good boy, yes, good boy, yes, good boy, yes, good boy, yes. Awesome dog, awesome dog, yes. Good boy, oh, what a good boy. Stan. So now we're going to try it from the other side. Mouse, you ready? Come on. Good boy. Yes, good boy. Yes, good boy. Awesome. Come on. Awesome. Awesome. Come on. Awesome. Come on. Awesome dog. Awesome dog. Come on. Right here. Yes, 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 yes. Good boy. Stand.